Hey guys, welcome back to Space Base DF9. As always, I'm Vicious V. Uh, couple things before we jump into the episode. Uh, I've noticed on a video or two that I am starting to get some audio um, disruption. And uh, I've got a new mic, or a on, on, on new mic on the way, but right now. If if you guys notice some disturbance or some some garbly sounds, I'm sorry. Uh, I will be fixing it. So last time we were building on our building on our base, naming our crew, uh, and I just gotten some new crew members. And I actually um, I immediately saved and exited out of the game as those new cr crew came in. So I have not seen what is in store for us so let's jump back into it uh, we need to pause uh, what do I got? I got one guy one girl um, oh, holy jeez builder, technician, miner, bartender all at three that's amazing uh, I'm gonna make her a technician, uh, cause well, I need more than than one. They've been working on improving the technician AI quite a bit, but I've been read I've still been reading in the forums a lot of issues with uh with technicians not doing what they're supposed to do um, now one other thing I've read in the forums which I may have mentioned in the last video was that they have fixed the reactor such that it does nothing in the game at current but you can build it without crashing the game not demolish objects. For that reason, I'm gonna go ahead and put a reactor in. I think this is large. No. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, I'll have to expand this. I'm gonna put a reactor in. Or, ooh, is this large enough? I think the center room is large enough. Hmm. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna do it. Last episode I said that this was not going to be temporary uh, life support. That I was in fact going to make that my full scale life support because it's the center of the base. I've changed my mind. I have altered the deal. Pray I do not alter it farther. Um, by which I mean, I'm going to move the life support into here. We need to put a door in there for that to be any good at all. Do, do, do. Objects. BD1. 1 BDI. Ah, uh, Leela. Okay, uh, confirm have our builders build that we will slowly get to transitioning this to a power room and uh, this to life support and then we need to work on transitioning all this uh, I can dismantle that now demolish V I can work on transitioning all of this to be gone <laughs> be gone with you okay and we'll confirm that for now now we will go to triple speed because simply put there's not enough stuff going on for me to play at any slower speeds at the moment we'll see what happens when I get some more crew and some more stuff going on Metacorn J Self's technician skill has improved. So. 
Yes, I have. Uh, I have actually received some comments from uh, from some of the namesakes of my crew members. Specifically, where'd he go? No, not Demos. Oh, where where did you go, Dougie? Dougie. Dougie Crowley has commented that uh, <laughs> that I made the apparently dumbest crew member, the the first crew member to decide that the floor was a better sleeping place than a bed, the uh, the botanist, and named him after it. I stand by my decisions. I stand by all my decisions always, whether you like them or not, agree with them or not, especially if you if you are a namesake for my crew members. I choose what I name my crew members very carefully and for specific reasons. <laughs> okay, an incoming ship. Okay, so we've got possibly new crew, hopefully not another unwanted addition to the station. Is that built now? I believe that is I believe that is built now. No. I don't think it is. So it's green. And these are white well, white and blue because of the coloration of the room. But so I don't believe that's been built yet. Let's keep going. We'll see what happens. Actually, let's do this. The um life support has become what? S S yes, uh, and then one. We'll put one of those there, one of those there, uh, one of those there. And then we'll go back. We'll say all zones. We will say fire extinguisher is five and rotate it and. Ah on the wall there and then I also want an emergency alarm which I've never used so I don't know how this is gonna work but this place goes up in fire in flames I want that there for sure alright we will confirm all of that and unpause Ow, my matter is going down. Alright, starship information unavailable. Hey there, how you doing? Shuttling past. Oh, shuttling past. Shuttling past is my keyword for this is crew and not a pirate attack. Um. Yeah. Because at least until the devs see this or someone else do a pl uh, let's play and comment on that and decide that uh, they want to change it, this has always been 100% guaranteed. Um, I wonder what's going on. Growth, 89%. Uh, not the door. Not. Mm, I want to look at the metacorn. You will not let me. Ooh, ooh. I had it. I had. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. There we go, 82%. Okay, some new citizens. Let's hit the roster. Let's see what we've got. Chobra Orbra. Oh, Chobra Obra. Um, I do not have a bartender. Let's see, is Chobra male or female? Uh, well, can't really tell. I, at least I can't. I, if there is some reasoning to the way, yeah, okay. Um, if there's some reasoning to the way that um, the alien species identify as gender, I'm not sure what it is. Now, I have some characters that I can actually name. All right, we are going to do some name changing. Demos. Oh, how appropriate that this is how I'm going to change his name. I did not even plan this. 
is going to be replaced by Mr. Pink. No. Okay, that was not Mr. Pink. There we go. And then Dave Martin. <laughs> okay. Uh, Dave Martin is going to become Demos. And that's because I had actually originally planned to make Demos um, a security officer in the first place rather than a miner. I simply named him after the miner because I couldn't think of anyone better to name the miner after. Uh, so we've got Mr. Pink, um, female, female, uh, female. Here we go. Um, now, Chobra Obra is going to become uh, J. Zim. And he is our bartender. Okay. Uh, where is my base? There's my base. Still disassembling the floor out there, huh? Oh, let me check on... Come on. There we go. Let me check on my builder's oxygen level. 59%. Oh, I don't have to watch that. I've been reading on the forums that if you give builders too large of a building project, they will run out of oxygen. I'm back. So, let's continue. Uh, no, full speed. Full speed ahead! Uh, I only have one builder, don't I? That's why stuff's not getting done in here, because I only have one person. Yup. No, I have two builders. Two. One. Two. I do not know where my other builder is. Probably... Yep, right there. Sheila's a chicken! Uh, technician skill... Food in your garden is ready to harvest... Hey, uh, 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 food in your garden is ready to harvest. You need a stove, a refrigerator, and a bartender in your pub to turn the crops into a cooked meal. So we need to work on a pub. Um, we're going to do that very soon, but for now, we're going to hold off. Um, we, my people are flying around. Wait, who's that? Who's the one in the white suit? A foreman. Who... Why was he in a white suit and not in a builder's suit? I do not know. Okay. Yes, yes, food in my garden is ready. I understand. Another incoming ship! Yes, yeah, see, this is how things get hectic quickly. Uh, technician skill. Do, 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 do. Whoa, what is going on? There is an unexplored derelict. A derelict has appeared. Um, so I guess this was the incoming ship. <sighs> we will, I'm going to hold off on going there. Um... And I'm going to recommend that this ship design be revisited because it is one straight extension away from having a really questionable appearance. Okay, so derelict and derelict. Okay. Back to ludicrous speed. Yes, my oxygen levels are low. That's not what I'm yesing about, by the way. I'm just. What 
was that? I didn't see what that was. Open back up! Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, it won't open up again. <sighs> okay, whatever. I'm sure it wasn't, you know, base destroyingly important. Now, um. We need to get rid of these. This, this, this. Confirm. Now, I know it'll just disappear if I rezone the room, but I don't know if I will get refunded the materials that way. And I would rather make sure that I get refunded the materials. Okay, and my builders are done what they're doing out there. We're going to make this a reactor room. Um, pause. Build. Objects. Reactor is T1, and we'll place a reactor in there. So that is going to be ready to go for whenever they activate reactors, unless some patch between now and then or that patch invalidates this, and I have to start all over just, just because. Um... So now, we need to work on getting our... Do, 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 do. Yeah. Getting our... Oh, I said wall. I don't want wall. I want room. Uh, we need to work on getting our, our pub, our eatery, up and running. Uh, what is that? One, two, three in between? I need I need more more room just in case I need to expand to that. Let's do five in between. Um and Yeah, that's good for now. Okay, technician skill, food in the garden zone. I know about that. We're working on that. Uh, what do we want to do? What would... Oh, we're paused. Derp. What do we want to do over here? See, I like my little 5x5 five five room with an airlock or a hallway uh, thing that I do. Uh, incoming ship. But I don't know... I don't know what I would put over there. Another derelict has appeared. Wow! I could have sworn I had low magnetic interference. Which should not have derelicts flying in right and left. Uh... You know what? Let's look at... Let's do objects. What do we have that we haven't built? The pub, 